okay what's up guys i'm here to show you how to use the jquery mobile in the offline mode okay uh, let's get started i'm going to open the google um, and i'm going to search for the jquery mobile framework jquery mobile framework download then i'm going to this download jquery mobile section okay after that uh, to use the jquery mobile in the offline mode uh, we only need these three files the first one is the css file which is in the minified versions uh, the minified version why the developer create the minified version is just to reduce the size of the file and the second one is the javascript file which is the popular javascript jquery library and the third one is, is the javascript jquery mobile library okay uh, before um, downloading this file i am going to open my terminal and create some useful directories mkjir and jquery this is our project directory and i'm going inside this directory and create further two more directories called css and js mkjir css js under this css directory i'm going to store this css file and under this js directory i'm going to store these two files and jquery min.js and jquery mobile.min.js okay i'm going to copy this url and going to save this in the css directory duplicate using the duplicate command i am downloading the css file again okay, i am going to do the same for this file also I need to switch to the JS directory and uh, I'm going to download this jQuery library again for this one also duplicate okay we are done with the downloading of file and after that I'm going to uh, make the main HTML file sublime main.html control s I'm going to save this one I'm going to close with I'm going to also I'm going to close this one and I'm going to save it. okay top type HTML 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 head title sorry title and word title and I'm going to close the head tag uh, we need to provide the CSS and JavaScript file for this project okay I'm going to provide the CSS file linking the css file with name is series css this is the css file that we need to use i'm going to copy the name of this file i'm going to use this one css slash this and then we need the javascript file the source for the javascript file will be this I'm going to use this one and then point the JavaScript file again I'm going to do the same for the second one JavaScript file source will be source this is the second JavaScript file that we need to include in our project Okay. After that, I need to create the body sections for our project where our content remains. Body. Okay, I'm going to create the content page page for our project using C data role. Deep. 
data role equal to page. this will be our page I'm going to create the header Deep data role equal to header section under which I'm going to put my header hello jQuery mobile after that I am going to create the content deep data role equal to the content in the content sections I am going to paste some dummy text I am going to copy the dummy text from this page I am going to use this dummy text after that I'm going to create the footer. The data role will be the footer. As mm, one, okay. You can also use as to tag. It doesn't matter. Dollar, sorry, copy. Okay, I'm going to run this project using Google Chrome html i'm going to check here you are this is our project that's that you can see this is completely a responsive site okay uh, if you like my tutorial you can click the subscribe button down below thank you for watching the video